Hello, dear friends. I am Violetta from Crafting with View of You. Asteroid Belt Mandala, Part 7. Round 61. Please join yarn, color B. And we will start with the front post double crochet into the front post double crochet two rounds below. Next, please work four single crochet stitches. And now double crochet slanted one stitch to the right. So from the corresponding stitch, one stitch to the right. Double crochet slanted one stitch to the right. Then a double crochet slanted one stitch to the left. And four single crochet stitches. Skip the past stitch behind, the two double crochet stitches behind, and work four single crochet stitches. So this is the pattern for this round. Now let's do it again one more time. Double front post double crochet, four single crochet stitches. Double crochet, slanted one stitch to the right. Double crochet, slanted one stitch to the left and four single crochets. Please repeat this pattern 32 times. Round 62. Please join your own color A. And you can work this round with a hook uh, half, uh, half size up. And we will start with a single crochet into the back loop of the front post double crochet. So single crochet into the back loop. Then three front post double crochet stitches into these three front post double crochets. So one, two, and three. Then a double crochet stitch, it goes into this single crochet right here. Okay, it's hidden under this slanted double crochet. Then two single crochets, they go into the back loops of these two slanted double crochets. So one and two. Then a double crochet into this single crochet right under this one. Okay, front loop two rounds below. And then three front post double crochets. One, two, and three. And this will be the pattern for this round. Let us do it one more time together single crochet, three FDCs, one, two, and three, double crochet, two single crochets, double crochet, three front post double crochets, one, two, and three. It's an easy round, so please finish it and join me back after you're done. Round 63. Let us join yarn color B and we'll start with the front post double crochet around this front post double crochet two rounds below so front post double crochet then five a single crochet stitches one two 
three, four, and five. Then a front post double crochet around these two slanted double crochets. So hook under the double crochet slanted one stitch to the right and under double crochet slanted one stitch to the left and a front post double crochet. Then do not skip any stitches in the back and work five single crochets. One, two, three, four, and five. So this is the pattern for this round. And let us do it one more time together. Well, it's very easy, but still let's do it. Front pose double crochet, five single crochet stitches, Front pose double crochet, no skip, five single crochets. So it's front pose double crochet, five, five single crochets, front pose double crochets, uh, no skip single crochet, uh, five single crochets, and like this all the way around this round. And you can use your regular uh, hook size, no need to go up half size. Round 64, please join yarn color A, make a chain stitch, and we will start with a single crochet into the back loop of the front post, double crochet. So, single crochet stitch, then four front post double crochets into these four stitches, two rounds below. So, one, two, three and four front post double crochets, then a double crochet into the single crochet, then a single crochet into the back loop of the front post double crochet, then a double crochet into the single crochet stitch to round below, and then four front post double crochets. One, two, three and four. And this will be the pattern for this round. Let us do it one more time together. Single crochet, four front post double crochets, one, two, three, and four, double crochet, single crochet, double crochet, four front post double crochets Oops. one two three and four now please pause this video and finish this round round 65 Please join yarn color B. And this is a very easy round. Front post double crochet, five single crochets. One, two, three, four, and five. And this is the repeat pattern for this round. Front post double crochet, five single crochets. And work like this 64 times around this round. And after you've done, please join me back for the round number 66. Round 66. Let us join yarn color A. And if you thought that the repeat in the last round was short, this one is even shorter. We will start with a single crochet stitch into the back loop of the front post double crochet. And then two front post double crochets. And this is the repeat for this round. 
So next stitch is a single crochet and then two front post double crochets. Then single crochet, two front post double crochets, single crochet, two front post double crochets, and like this around this round. Round 67. In this round, we will use yarn color B and also yarn color C if you are using accent color. So join your yarn B and work a front post double crochet, then two single crochets. Do not finish your second single crochet. Join yarn C into the last two loops of this stitch. And then work a puff stitch into the single crochet two rounds below. So our little puff. Finish the last uh, loop with yarn color B. Then arrange, place the these two yarns along the edge and work over them two single crochet stitches one and two, just like we did here or lower. So this is the pattern for this round. Let us do it one more time. I lost my stitch. Come here. Yes, so we will start with a front post double crochet, then two single crochets. Join yarn C into your last single crochet. I lost my purple hook and this one is not very comfortable so it splits the yarn so where are you so join your yarn C then make a puff stitch into the single crochet join yarn B and make two single crochet stitches And like this, please continue working this round all the way around. Round 68. Please join yarn color A. And we will start with a single crochet into the back loop of the front post double crochet. So single crochet stitch, then two front post double crochets, one and two, and then two slanted double crochets together. One will be um, worked into this front post double crochet and the other into this front post double crochet into the front loops of these stitches. So we are going to find that uh, front loop right under this front post double crochet start making a double crochet slanted one stitch to the right leave two loops on the hook start making a double crochet slanted one stitch to the left and finish these stitches together and then work two front post double crochets the first front post double crochet is worked into the same stitch into which you worked the double crochet slanted one stitch to the left so right into this stitch right here, one and two. So in the end, we will have six stitches in this repeat. The first is the single crochet, then two front post double crochets, then the double crochet slanted one stitch to the right and to the left together, and then two front post double crochets. So six stitches in this repeat. Let's do it one more time. Single crochet, two, um, two front post double crochets, double crochet slanted one stitch to the right and to the left together, 
So double crochet, slanted one stitch to the right, double crochet, slanted one stitch to the left together, and two front post double crochets. So one and two. And if you want, we can do it one more time. So single crochet into the back loop of the front post double crochet, two front post double crochets, double crochet into the same stitch into which you made the last front post double crochet, don't finish it, double crochet into the next front post double crochet, finish these two stitches together, and then two front post double crochets, one and two. And now please pause this video and finish this round. Round 69, please join yarn color B and we will start with a single crochet into the back loop of this single crochet right here, the first stitch of the previous round. So single crochet into the back loop of the single crochet. Next, a slanted double crochet, one stitch to the right, so right into this stitch, double crochet, slanted one stitch to the right, and as usually I work through two loops, it's easier with my purple hook, okay, so double crochet, slanted one stitch to the right, then we're going to skip the corresponding stitch, work three single crochet stitches, one, two, three, and then double crochet, slanted one stitch to the left, so into the front loops of this front post double crochet right here. So to the left, and this will be the pattern for this round, we're going to skip the corresponding stitch and work a single crochet into the back loop of the single crochet, then double crochet, slanted one stitch to the right, skip the corresponding stitch, three single crochets, double crochet, slanted one stitch to the left, and like this we're going to work all the way around this round. Just six stitches in the repeat. Please pause this video, finish this round, and we'll meet again in round 70. Round 70. In this round, we will work with yarn color A and yarn color C. We'll start with joining yarn C, make a chain stitch, and the first stitch in this round is a puff stitch, which is a two double crochets clusters. It's a cluster of two double crochets together, so two double crochets into the same stitch together. So let's do it. Puff stitch. Please join yarn A into this puff stitch, like this, and then work a single crochet using yarn A into the back loop of the slanted double crochet. Next, please work three front post double crochet into this front post double crochet into these two slanted double crochets together and then into this front post double crochet. So front post double crochet, then front post double crochet around both, around the um, two double crochets together, and then front post double crochet into the next front post double crochet. Then please work a single crochet around yarn C like this and join yarn C into your single crochet and this is the pattern for this round let us do it a couple of more times together work a puff stitch into the single crochet two rounds below right in between these two slanted double crochets 
so one two double crochets join yarn a drop yarn c grab yarn a work a single crochet into the back loop of the slanted double crochet then three front post double crochets one two hold this yarn to your skin here and three then a single crochet into the back loop of the slanted double crochet join yarn a um c then work a puff stitch into the single crochet two rounds below join yarn a single crochet three front post double crochets then single crochet join yarn c and continue like this all the way around this round. <laughs> 